My name's Tracy and I'm a co-presenter here at uh, the Brownlee Friends and Request show. So 10 years ago I have twin sons and they both got convicted so they listened to prison radio so that brought me here. It's about uh, family and friends sending requests to loved ones in prison and vice versa and it's the only show on national prison radio that we can listen to online as well so the family and friends can hear the request and listen to the show. We get lots of different messages. We get birthday ones when it's a celebration, Christmas, Valentine's. We even had a proposal. I don't think people realise the importance of somebody sat in their room at night and probably not going to speak to somebody again after say half six or whatever. And the radio's on and they hear their name and a family, especially the voice requests that we've got now. They can hear families' voices. And, and just to know that somebody's thinking about them and have took the time to either write in, ring up for a voice request and, and pick a song that means something to them, yeah, definitely encourage lots more people to do it. Dean Lynch and I'm a presenter on the Family and Friends Request show on National Prison Radio and we are Straight Line. So the power of music is definitely real. I think one, it either matches the mood you're in or it can turn your mood around entirely. I think it's important because it keeps you in touch with the outside life. Um, being in prison, you're definitely shut off to that. Well, I did personally anyway. If you do have a family a member or friend inside the prison, please do use Family and Friends Request Show. Leave a message and pick a song that's gonna cheer up someone's day and let someone know you're thinking of them. National Prison Radio, we are straightline.com.